Hello everyone, here I am in a, at a beautiful beach here in beautiful Bodin Gan. Look at this beauty. Paradise, right? But this is also Bodin Gan. This is how you find many of the rivers and beaches and all along the side of the roads when you're driving. This is how our communities are. This is how our home is. This is how with many treat this beautiful paradise. And that's not, oh, that's not only it. You'll find it all through here. All through here. And th this was worse before. I cleaned it up a little. A mountain of trash here. Look at this. This is a mound of plastic. And I am going to be cleaning this. Because I can't stand idly by and allow the destruction of this beautiful paradise. If I could do something about it, if we could do something about it, look at this. Treat it like a landfill. I have to be careful here, you see that? A burnt car. And yes, I think the government should come in here and clean this. But it's not the responsibility, look at this, all that, a toilet and more stuff over there. It's not the responsibility of the government. You know, many people want trash cans everywhere. The problem is not trash cans. I think it's the irresponsibility of many people. And many people being lazy because they could have a trash can 10 feet away and they'd rather throw it on the ground. Like one of my signs reads, today you leave your trash Tomorrow your kids will play in it, and that's the reality. This is your children's inheritance. And I think we have to start doing something about it. You know, they, they, they say, La playa son de pueblo. The beaches are the peoples, and that's true. But this is how many other people demonstrate that this beach is theirs. And I think we have to start taking care of these beautiful beaches wherever we are. For the last eight years, I have been doing this, my one bag challenge. And I already picked up one half a bag here. And I'm going to pick up as much as I can. I have more bags, so I'm going to go a little bit beyond what I normally do. But I know next week, or the week after, it's going to get trashed again. And that's the sad reality. And this is the hard part of doing this work that I have been doing for the last eight years. You know, it's a struggle. You know, you try to, to take care of all this magic. This is magic. Look at that. that. Ah, magic. We have to start taking care of it. You know, I love this island. This is where I connected deeply to nature. And this is where I feel indigenous to the world. My roots connected straight to mother nature in ways I, I could never imagined. And so now I choose to be the spokesperson of nature. <laughs> um, but yes, I'm going to be cleaning this up right now. Let's see the before and see the after. You've seen that. Let's see this. Straws everywhere. We, we ignore the straws. We don't care about that. We, we walk by this many times. You know, we don't even have to do one bag. We could just pick up a straw here and there. Any, anything that we could do to take care of Mother Earth, it's a big step in the right direction. Because we are that change, baby! Let's be that change! I'm going to get down here and clean all this. That's right, right by the ocean. It goes straight down into the, uh, that spot right there and goes into the ocean. So let's clean this up. And you know, I don't believe in beach cleanups because I believe that we are the beach cleanups. Look at this. Oh, boy. We are the beach cleanup. We could make a difference. Any little thing that we could do makes the, busy, the biggest impact. We, we are that change. And we need to realize that. That we have the power to change things, not the government. So, let's be that change. much better now and I'm sure there's a lot of garbage under that but hey I did my part for that now I'm gonna keep on going 
So I collected this whole bag here. Look how big this is. Oh, and it stinks. You know, I, I, I stopped drinking seven years ago. And that's my, the best decision that I have ever made. And what is repulsing to me is always smelling that poison that I used to drink. Every time I have to pick up a beer can or a some alcoholic beverage. So it's, um, yeah, that's what I did here. The beach is much, much cleaner through here. I did this right here. So I take the time to come and clean the beach all the time. As I said, I think we are the change. There's so much more, I can't, there's so much more for one man. So I, I invite anyone to come to the beach and if you see a trash like this, let's do our part. Let's start taking care of it. And so now I take the trash and put it in my car, which is being held by a stick and which is the only entrance to my car because my both of my doors don't open. So I have to go in through here always. So this is my journey. <laughs> and the reason I am not going to leave it by the side of the road is because people are going to see it and assume that's the trash can and they will they will continue to add on to that garbage. So I'd rather put it in my car and take it somewhere. A dumpster and that I could put it in. And it's that simple. Um, so, yeah. Escucha y mira. Las bellezas de la vida, yeah. Despierta a toda esta belleza de la madre naturaleza, yeah, yeah. This is how I end my day with the artwork of nature.